Hey guys, welcome to another tutorial. So today I'm going to show you how to bridge objects in Blender. All right, so I'm going to show you a few ways on how to do it and which one is the easier. So I'm just going to add, um, let's add a, like a two cubes here and let me duplicate this one. I'm going to put it right there. I have Shift D, you can duplicate an object. So we're going to join this this two, Control and J is going to uh, join these two. And I'm going to move this one, uh, wait, uh, let me select the whole thing, move it back. Now let me show you how to, uh, how we can connect these uh, two objects, all right? Let's say I want to connect this uh, side with this one right here. So there's a way you can just select, you know, those faces and start, you know, connecting, like uh, selecting both uh, edges and pressing F, and he's going to uh, connect those, uh, those sides, right? So that's a really long process. You can do it too with uh, vertex mode. You go here and you press F and immediately it's going to connect those sides, right? But the easier way for me, I think, is uh, with the uh, phase mode. You're going to select those two, press W and go here to add bridge edge loops and voila. There you go. You have connected uh, those two. Um, size right there so you, you don't even have to delete the faces inside because he's just going to merge those two right there and I'm going to do it again I'm gonna extrude this one repeat it with shift r it's going to repeat the last uh, action that you did if you select this one select that one press w and select bridge edge loops and there you go right it's a quick and easy way on how to bridge faces vertices or um, edges or whatever just easier okay it, it, it's gonna work either way if you select you know, like all the vertices or whatever you have the faces selected it's gonna do the same process there you go or even though if you select like these two and these two it's gonna do the same thing there you go so either way that you select when you do the uh, uh, the action is going to do it like it's gonna bridge whatever you have selected right there that's how the tool works it's pretty easy to do so there you go all right guys thank you and see you in the next one